it felt astonishingly normal. Um, and like we hadn't really stopped making the first film. Um, I mean, I, that's an odd thing to say because there was a, a space of time between, less so for me because I became involved in thinking about this second film fairly soon after at least the American release, which is a long way after the European release. Um, but because it was the same people, because we were extending the stories, we were extrapolating the stories forward, we were in the same uh, location. Um, it, it felt as if we just hadn't quite stopped, you know, it was, which is kind of interesting because in the story we haven't quite stopped. Uh, I mean, it, it, the, the second film, as you know, takes place about eight, eight months later. Just because we didn't want to stand in place, we wanted to jump forward and so we kind of developed their situation a little bit beforehand. But the continuity is there. I mean, it was it was wonderful to go back, but it, and it, it was, um, yeah, it, it felt like home. Well, you don't get that chance ever in a movie, in my experience. I mean, I've certainly never done it before. Uh, and the parallel, as I think I might have said to you before, is, is with television, really, because that's now a very common thing. You, you take the kind of paradigm of a let's say an American cable show, you write a pilot without knowing whether there's going to be any interest in that, that then becomes a series probably of 10 episodes or films and you don't know whether it's going to go beyond that. So now you're, you're starting to develop characters in collusion with an audience who are familiar with them, um, who know their quirks and their contradictions. And, and then you're in a, involved in a sort of mutual exploration, which is kind of interesting. I mean, obviously there are sequels everywhere. That's now the business of Hollywood because it's a commercial model they like because they think they can rely on a, a predictable audience. But it's full of traps that you don't want to make. I didn't want to make the same film again. I wanted to see where these characters who've after all changed their lives in a very dramatic way would you know, how they would be developing. Because again, you don't see that very often with people of this age, you know, they are old. That's all there is to say about them, they're old. And in this case, it's not all there is to say about them. There's a great deal to say about them. <laughs>